we're here at the Mapleton Farmer's Market and we're going to be doing a watermelon salad today. We also have a yellow meat watermelon from Mr. McCarver um, Farm. And if you've never had a yellow meat watermelon, come by the market and try it. It's delicious. I'm going to be saving the seeds and trying to grow some myself. But what we're going to be making today is a watermelon salad. And here is a watermelon salad. This one has feta cheese in it. I'm actually not putting the feta in it today. I'm going to do a simpler version of that. It has water, three ingredients, watermelon, lemon juice, and mint. And if your watermelon is not sweet enough, you can add a little honey, but I don't think we're going to be needing the honey today. So we've already chunked up our watermelon in big, nice chunks, all right? And we're going to be adding simple lemon juice and the mint. And I've chopped up the mint, and this is fresh lemon juice. And that's all to this recipe. And I'm actually going to add the lemon juice in here with the mint. And over here. That's basically it. And just for a little flavor, just for a little extra, I'm going to add really just a little honey on here. As I said, you don't have to add the honey, but you can. Excuse me. It's very hot out here today, so I feel all kind of things on me. So I'm going to just drizzle a little honey on here. As I said, it's up to you whether you add the honey or not. And that's basically it. That's basically your watermelon salad. And I have so much in here, but I'm going to try and toss it because you want your watermelon to stay firm. That's the key here. The watermelon needs to be pretty firm so you can actually keep it in chunks and make it look pretty. And I'm actually going to add in a little bit of the yellow watermelon just to add some color to it. Actually, I'm going to add in all of this. I have a few seeds, but I didn't mean to put the seeds in there. Yeah, the yellow crazy, one is just going to add just a little color to that. Look how pretty that makes when you add in the yellow. And if you want to take this a step further, you can also add um, berries, strawberries, apples, or anything else that you want to add. But this is basically it. The mint just gives it an extra little flavor. And I think it's going to be delicious. Let me just try just a little bit here before I let you guys taste it. I'm going to see what it's going to be. Hmm. Yeah, like the different pop. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, ladies, y'all want to try some? Yeah, I'm going to taste it. Okay. All right. So, thank you so much. I hope you like it. <laughs>